In our earlier tutorials, we have covered most of the basic types of formatting such as color fills, borders, and font. In this section, we are going to go into a little more depth and introduce some less commonly used formatting tools. As you probably already know, most formatting tools are located in the Excel ribbon. However, there are other places where you can find formatting commands. Formatting tools are available in three different locations. The Home tab ribbon, the Format Cells dialog box, and the Mini Toolbar. Although most formatting commands available in the Home tab ribbon are usually sufficient enough, there are some commands that can only be applied by using the Format Cells dialog box. To make formatting changes using the Format Cells dialog box, select a range of cells using one of the following methods. You can press Control-1 on your keyboard. You can click on the Home tab and then in the Font, Alignment, or Number group, click on the Dialog box launcher in the bottom right corner of the group. You can also right click and from the shortcut menu select Format Cells or you can select more commands from one of the drop down menus. The Format Cells dialog box has six different tabs, Number, Alignment, Font, Border, Fill, and Protection. With the Format Cells dialog box, you are able to make all formatting changes available in the Home tab ribbon along with some other commands that are not available in the ribbon. The best way to get familiar with formatting cells using both the ribbon and the Format Cells dialog box is to simply experiment with it on your own. Another way to make some quick formatting changes is to use the mini toolbar. The mini toolbar offers you an even more efficient way to perform the absolute most common formatting commands. Some people find the mini toolbar annoying, but it can be more efficient since you don't have to go through the different ribbon tabs to access certain commands. The mini toolbar contains controls for the most common formatting commands, such as font, font size, increase font, decrease font, accounting number format, percent style, comma style, format painter, bold, italics, center, borders, fill color, font command, increase decimal, decrease decimal, and finally merge and center. 